Hey guys, it's Dintelega, and uh, this YouTuber called Wayya Studios has released uh, a third version of his mod pack for Super Smash Bros. for Wii U. Uh, the mod pack includes different skins and everything uh, for the characters, and it's completely reversible if you don't uh, if you don't want to keep it and everything. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys how to install this. So the first thing you need is to get a, an SD card. I have mine right here. It's over here. Second, there it is. No, it's in here. 3.9. All right. Yeah. So you can see my DCIM. It's just this is just a uh, thing, right? It's just just a thing. I'm gonna show you some examples, some example pictures. This is just the classic. See everything. See, I have, I have Dat Boy right there. You know what I'm saying? All right. So what you want to do is you want to go into you want to go inside the, uh, your folder or your SD card. You want to click new. You want make a new folder. And the folder that you want to make is going to be called uh, this number right here, which I'll put into the description. That's the number for uh, the American, for the NTSC we use, uh, which is, you know, America, Canada. I think Mexico is included in that as well. Maybe maybe Greenland, I'm not sure. Uh, but if we use NTSC, we'll use this code. I'll put that into the description. Uh, the other codes, I'm actually not sure of. I'm sorry. Um, for Europe or Japan. Anyway, so you go and sit here. Um, and you want to download this folder right here which I believe I have on my desktop no I do not want it to do that yes I, believe, yes I have it right here so I, you da I downloaded it right here and if you're using Windows you're going to get uh, w um, WinRAR install WinRAR, WinRAR uh, and you just want to open up this folder right and you will find um, patch and sound you just want to drag the patch and sound folder into your folder you just made inside your SD card Drag them to there, probably take like say 10 minutes. Uh, and it'll also come with this little folder in here that will tell you um, all the characters and what the new skins are and everything. Alright, so what you want to do is get your SD card and just open up the flap in your Wii U and just insert it in there. And turn on your console. And make sure to get your gamepad because you'll need it to run the exploit to uh, run the mod and the skins and everything in Smash Brothers. Alright, so let's go in your profile. Also, Smash Bros. should be inside your console right now. If it's not already, open up your internet browser. And you want to go to a URL I will put into the description called Loadin. I'm already on it right now. Loadin. So you want to click over here. Yes. And you want to scroll down until you see SD Caffeine plus kernel and click submit and then I'll run a thing that looks kinda of like a video All right and we'll go back to the page after that you wanna go back in your browser and then you wanna go back to the site right if it doesn't automatically do this then you just need to type back in the site and go back on it Alright, so bring it to this bring it to this page. And um, you just need to click the A button. And then you can go Wii U menu and run Smash Brothers. And I'll just show you when it runs. Yeah, it'll have a kind of a funky loading loading screen. Yep, so just go on Smash. Smash. Move it a light. And as you can see, uh, the guys have all the characters in here have turned into kind of weird images. And if you just go on one, for example, uh, where is he? I believe Toon Link. Yeah, if you just wait a, wait a couple seconds, the pictures of the guys will come up. You can, you can just go on them. You can step and change it. No, you cannot. All right, no touch screen. I don't use the gamepad as often. All right, you can see now he is Shovel Knight. I'll see an example, right? Shovel Knight, and then go over here. Let's make him uh, Steve from Minecraft. Apparently, he's called Lonk on this thing now. Then you can change it to different variations of Link. That done. And you even have some kind of weird stages also, like you have 
uh, the test stage with test room, which you can't die on. An all-star stage, really, some of them are kind of weird and funky. Like, where is it? This is, uh, this one right here. It's a bit changed. Anyways, so let's just go to, go to a standard stage. You can see it is Shovel Knight and it is Steve. Yeah, uh, this helped you out. Make sure you guys leave a like. Thanks, thanks for watching. And, uh, have fun. And also, for, I forgot to mention, uh, if you just want to undo the mod, all you gotta do is exit Smash Brothers. If you want to reverse the mod, just exit out, uh, And I think I'm not sure exiting exiting them. I just do it, but just but just in case, turn off your console. Just pressing the power button, and uh, done. Your mods pretty much your mods uninstalled.